This custom tactic would give you so many options going forward in FIFA 22 and beyond. Lately I've been sort of testing out custom tactics, formations, etc, etc in FIFA just to see what else works and what else will basically give us better attacking options, better defensive setups, etc, etc. And what I've been using lately is overlap on my wing bats. What this has done is it has given me so many options going forwards with little to none risk when you are attempting to defend. What I mean by that is if you have your wing bats on overlap set to in the play instructions and then you have them on mixed attack, they will run back as soon as you lose the ball and get back into the line of defense before the opponent counter attacks. What I will say though is if you are not that confident in defending and your defending is let's say a little bit shaky and it needs work and you haven't yet got right stick switching down pat, you haven't yet got uh, jockeying down pat, tracking runs down pat, I recommend at least perfecting the basics first so that you're more competent in the defense because you will be defending with two centre bats briefly and I say briefly because as I said they will run back but it would give you a lot more options going forwards and that's the risk that I want to take. What I notice is, if you use the wing attack technique where we draw the defense out to the wing to open up gaps in the center, which I've promoted all throughout FIFA 22, and I can guarantee to you guys, although I'm not sure about what it will be like in FIFA 23, every single year previous to FIFA 22, this attacking technique has worked. You take it to the wing and you drag defenders out. What I've noticed is it gives you an extra player making those overlapping runs, which means it's easier for us to get up the line a lot better. Okay, We might need to build it up with just the wingers up there. We might need to take a lot more time. Okay, But if you're looking to get up there quickly, the wing bats are over overlapping. They're always making runs up, which means you can hold it up with your winger, then play the wing bat through. And a lot of the time, there'll be options in the middle once you've drawn that defense out. I've noticed this tactic is super, super effective in FIFA 22, and I'm pretty sure it's going to be pretty effective in FIFA 23 and beyond. I think you guys should at least give it a try. See how you go defensively. I will say, if you start conceding more goals more often than not, then work on your defense. Because if you're not confident in the defense, this is something I don't recommend to you guys. But if you are and you're lacking in that attack, this is a super effective way of giving yourself more options going forwards and drawing the defense out because you will be able to attack up the wing more efficiently. Super effective, it's simple, and give it a try, lads. It's a short but sweet one for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm coaching one on one, of course, on patreon.com. Link is down below. Many testimonials proving I've taken people from low divisions to high divisions in a matter of months can be done. Link is down below, of course. Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, all of the above, lads. Keep in touch with your boy over there. But uh, yeah, as always, I hope you have a good day. I'm out. Sign up. Au revoir. Adios. Ciao.